and we're ready to go here with the, the yeah. second map, so which this is Execution Hotel. hotel. Execution. Well, I'm just going to finish what I was going to say there. Um, you look at <laughs> Apex and how they're playing. They obviously have great Lancer support, really good close quarters support. So yeah. their game's tight from that <laughs> perspective. And it means that if one player is going to be taken out, the other players will kind of, the one player will basically sacrifice themselves, allow the other, t other players to kind of yeah. remain in the game until that player is able to come back themselves. Right, exactly. Although sometimes they can get the most horrible of spawns, so. Yes, but uh, the, you know, that, wasn't d that didn't hurt decisive, yeah. decisive hurt decisive. Yeah, so anyway, we can have a look at the word of power up and spawning here as the map uh, loads. So you've got Snub Pistols, which are bottom uh, right and left hand corner, which are irrelevant. Digger bottom up outside of the map and top bow inside. This is very much a mansion s map in terms of its layout, but only on one side of the rounds, because actually in, uh, in execution, each round, the weapons cycle. So let's see what each team's going to do. So, okay, one team's going to send three inside. I won't say too loud, so they can't hear. And it's going to be a 1v2 outside. Reese is going to be playing really aggressive with these two with his teammate. Reaction as well. Reaction where they were the first yeah. kill there on Indy Banks. He also taken out from Decisive. Yeah, that was no And that's going to be a one on four, four yeah. for Decisive. Nasher taken out there as the third man from. Northside chose to get the digger at the exact expense of his teammates' uh, support. Meanwhile, reaction is straight in there. No messing around. First round already. Here, Noxie taken out there. I'm not sure, honestly, what Decisive, decisive really needs to just start. I'm not saying desperate strats, but they need to just, you know, just start making some good instincts and just playing unorthodox because strategically Apex are far superior. So, so now the boom shot outside, so you're gonna see I'm a lot more focus on the outside. The boom shot being pretty much a rocket launcher. And it's a good way to see the setups there in yeah. the overhead view. And on board with reaction, yeah, who uh, was movement. very aggressive the last, last round. Oh, <laughs> Noxie yeah. there. Oh there for the taking. So he's going to play with slow. Now they had the advantage, and now they're probably going to work on the boom shot. There's no need to be too aggressive running into, uh, into you know, difficult kills where you can just grab the power weapon using numbers on your side. You're saying too, like, uh, Mansion S map yeah. from Gears of War 1. And the, the problem with that map, obviously, is everyone played that boom shot. Oh. Oh, oh. And then the well, that will solve don't it. Don't the battery. Hopefully solve itself. Sam will help us out. Come on, Sam, mate. Meanwhile, we can still somehow see through the uh, a very dark screen. Guys on the stream, we'll be right back. The uh, wireless controller has just disconnected. So all I can see is a menu right now. And I have a blurred vision of some cog guy. Awesome. And Samaya Moss has provided a replacement. Okay, we're back on board with Reese. 2v2. So not quite an advantage for Decisive, but maybe they can actually do some work here. The, the problem with having the stage about six feet off the ground is uh, having the Xbox on the stage makes it a pain in the neck. So we have to use a wireless controller. Yeah, right. Which is just yeah. I was looking for, for the trouble. Xbox earlier, and I thought it was just integrated into the TV or something. And uh, Jamesy there now yeah. on Indie is gonna uh, is use a boom shot for that kill. Yeah. So it's a two v one advantage. You have snipe and rocket. Not quite sure what Nasha can do here. Nice. <laughs> Some miscommunication. Obviously, decisive didn't realize that Fitz had another boom. Screaming at his teammate, he's got another boom shot. So two to zero so far. And Banksy, the only man actually picking up. Yeah, a lot of double dots right now. The equivalent of a donut. As we all know, to come on love. Let's go on board with reaction. Smokes still play a part um, of stunning people. They don't knock you over like in Gears 2, but they still, they're still tactical because they stun you, so they stop you from picking up power weapons temporarily. Yeah. Getting to see the Apex push now for the Torque Bow. So some great uh, lance fire by reaction from up top. His teammates are covering him. Reese will uh, pick up the first kill. Nashua will trade back both with uh, Fitzer. Okay, so now we've got another 3v1. In favor of Apex, obviously. And Noxide is just trapped between the H. He's re not really nothing much he can do here other than a miracle. Maybe just get one kill, though. No. Nope. No. 
Almost got lucky. Three, no. Three to zero. It's almost quite disappointing, really, that Apex is so good sometimes. Um, I think really uh, with this... Uh, it's good for Apex, though. It's great for Apex, but really um, Gears War 3 has a, a really a thriving online community, and I hope a lot of teams will w watching this will say, okay, I can have a piece of Apex. You know, I can do as uh, good, better than them, and uh, the level of competition will grow, and the people will get better, and Apex might actually have a challenge one day. So it's not side versus reaction. Both real-life mates. <laughs> reaction... <laughs> Apparently point blank thing, but reaction is saying absolute no to that. Another 3v1 situation in favor of Apex. Banksy by himself. Good position, to, best position he can be in mode a minute, but reaction is getting all sorts of angles on him. And it's a 4 0. Jamesy with the boom shot <laughs> is uh, making matters very hard yeah. for decisive. Reese didn't actually dive that round. Uh, Indian Noxide didn't actually get a kill. Um, so. Decisive, really. It's it's not. It's, it's got past the point where you're thinking, just do you know, go all out. I think they just need to. Uh, I don't know. Close their eyes or something and play. Because honestly, this isn't working out at all for them. They're sitting so far. You know, you look at. I mean, I guess <laughs> Apex and they're all about the same part way apart. These guys are, but they do seem like they could be a bit closer and talk a bit. <laughs> yeah. Get a bit more pumped up. Yeah. I mean, when you're losing, it's always hard to be you know to get the you know get some guts. And get but some the whole point is like you can you know <laughs> the upset. Yeah. Yeah. You never know. No. We've seen upsets in every game. Absolutely. I mean, you know, actually, we've seen some upsets before in Gears of War where people have come down from two maps down. At uh, this quality of play, though, they're really going to have to do something spectacular. <laughs> no, so just That's a good over. strategy. Just eye them up. <laughs> <laughs> guy, guy. Are they hosting? Yeah, so 